国际机场，一号客运大楼位于左边。Hello, everyone. Welcome to another flight review from me. Last year, as you may recall, I flew with Cafe Dragon on my birthday. Check out the video above if you haven't. This year, I decided to spend the special occasion with my favorite Cafe Pacific. Easy. Easy. Okay. I booked an economy class ticket, and I kept checking the mobile app on my way to the airport to see if I might have been upgraded. But alas, no such luck. But then, when I arrived at the airport, the lady at the counter wished me an early happy birthday and told me that the Marco Polo Club had arranged an upgrade to business class for me. After going airside, I headed to the Pier First Class Lounge. Some may wonder why I got an upgrade on my birthday. Let me tell you more about my understanding of Cafe's birthday policy. Firstly, and most importantly, you have to be a Marco Polo Club member, silver tier or above, meaning holding a green status is useless. With the status, Cafe will try to make your birthday a different one if you decide to spend this special occasion on board. If you are booked in the back cabin of the aircraft. You might be upgraded by one cabin, economy class to premium economy, or directly to business if premium economy is unavailable on the aircraft. But what if the front cabins on your flight is fully booked, or you've booked yourself in the front cabins? Then Cafe will offer you a box of chocolate like what I've received last year, and most of the time, cabin crew will prepare a birthday card for you. But there's no guarantee, so don't take it for granted. The pier lounge closed at 12:30 a.m., and I proceeded to my flight's boarding gate 15. To tie in with the new footbridge connected to the North Satellite Concourse, called Sky Bridge, a number of boarding gates at the Hong Kong International Airport will be renumbered. Gate 15 will be changed to Gate 5 on the 28th of March. As this was a Friday evening, this flight has a large number of elite members. The priority boarding lanes are even longer than the economy class lane. It seemed some economy passengers were even misled by the long priority queue and thought that it was the economy class queue. Boarding was smooth, though it took a bit longer due to the long queue. Hello, The manager by the door welcomed me on board and directed me to my seat. The Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin was in a two-three-two regional configuration, with a total of forty-two seats. Hello, welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boeing Triple Seven Dash Three Hundred Business Class cabin. Welcome to Boe
All lights in the cabin were off for the takeoff. According to my observation, many passengers put on their masks and slept. After takeoff, I began to explore the in-flight entertainment system. As recommended by a friend, I watched the Crazy Rich Asians. The system was yet to be updated and it was still the old interface. In the movie, there was a scene where Nick and Rachel was at the airport, and Cafe Pacific was shown on the signage at the airport. So proud the local airline of my hometown was included in this blockbuster. To my surprise, even though it was a red-eye flight, the cabin crew decided to turn on all the lights for a new service. The Japanese senior person began to give out menus to passengers. A simple supper served in a single tray was available. Drinks were first served, and I ordered a glass of water. Normally, meals on red-eye flights were served by hand as most passengers prefer to sleep. However, meals on this flight were served by trolley. The meal began with a seasonal berries with rose syrup. The dish is usually a dessert in long or first class, which was treated as an appetizer on today's flight. Garlic bread was also served. Normally, each passenger would be provided with two pieces of it on cafe, but perhaps there wasn't enough stock today. The flight attendant only served each passenger one piece of it. I asked for an extra piece. For main course, there was a choice between stir-fried chicken with steamed jasmine rice and grilled Australian beef tenderloin. I had the latter and it tasted quite good. For dessert, it was the lychee and mango mousse cake, and I loved it too. The menu said there was cheese, but I neither saw it nor asked for it. When most passengers have finished eating, there was another round of drink service and I got a cup of Hong Kong style milk tea to accompany the crazy rich Asians. A wide variety of wines was also available. Lights were once again dimmed, and I decided to try to slip a bit. Around 30 minutes before landing, lights were switched on, and the manager came to my seat with a tray of sake and my flight log. She greeted me with a happy birthday and said, I believe you have never seen this before. The sake is something exclusive on a Japanese flight. Take a photo as you will. Inside the flight log, there was a birthday card attached to it with messages written by all of the crew. Soon after, we began a descent into the Newritain National Airport. To summarize the flight, it was great. Although the flight was operated by regional business class recliners, I was able to get a solid two and a half hours sleep. The meal served was delicious. The manager was so sweet and lovely, and she was the first person who wished me a happy birthday. She even invited me to visit the cockpit after landing. That's all for today, and I would be transiting to a Japan Airlines flight on the same day to Shanghai. Want to know my birthday experience with JAL? Stay tuned and wait for my next video. Thanks for watching. Like, share, and subscribe. Also, watch One Root Flyers videos. See you.